Hi, boys and girls, little artists everywhere. It's Mrs. O'Brien here, and I'm ready to draw a scene along with you. I thought today that I would follow the inspiration of one of my students, who I'll never forget his very creative picture of a living room with a Christmas tree. And um, he had his sister on a ladder putting the star on top. So, that is going to be our scene for today, and I'm going to start with my paper going up and down so that I can make a really tall Christmas tree here. And um, if I remember correctly, he even had a chandelier that came down, and a window, and then the ladder that came up here. So that gives you an idea of what we're going to be doing today. So of course, I'm gonna start out with my green colored pencil, and I am just going to imagine a nice, tall tree and it's going to go up on the um, right hand side of my paper and I'm just going to make it go bigger and bigger as it goes down. I'm not going to make it perfect because we all know that no Christmas tree is exactly perfect. Um, and then I'm going to shade in some um, green leaves and coming down but I'm not going to color it in the whole way because I want to leave some room for some very, very sparkly lights and some ornaments on there. And um, so there's a tree. And of course, you want to pause your video if you want to so that you can catch up with anything that I am doing today. And um, remember to always like the video and subscribe if you can. So I'm just going to start with some all different colored lights. Um, just, I'm gonna make them little stars. I've got my orange out now and I'm just taking it and making little bright sparkles all over the tree in orange. And then I just have to pick up a bright pink, so I'm gonna go with that. And I think we'll need a Blue. And I'm just going to keep going with lots of different colors. And then I'm going to take a, oh, let's see, where's a yellow? A yellow. And I'm going to just do a um, kind of a crisscross going down so it kind of looks like the whole tree is lit, maybe even like with a ribbon or something. And that reminds me that we could put some maybe red, um, big red balls. Um, would be hanging down for ornaments. Uh, just decorate however you want. You could put some reindeer, or you could put some bells, you could put whatever, however you decorate your tree. Um, I'm now gonna take a green. Green won't show up very much. Let's see, I think I'll stick with red and do a few little um, bows maybe hanging off from there. All right, and thanks to that student, I'm now going to put my ladder, and I'm just going to use a brown. I'm going to put it going all the way up the side to the tall, tall tree. It looks a little scary if you ask me, but it kind of makes it kind of fun. So it's kind of leaning against the tree. Of course, you would never try this at home because you'd have to have an adult with you to make sure and the ladder would not be very sturdy against that. And then I'm just going to put a little, put some little girl just climbing her way up there. And in her hand is a big, maybe she'll be climbing down and I'll go on and put the yellow star on the top of the tree. That's what I think I'll do. Okay yellow star there. And then um, I'm going to put a yellow dress on her. She looks cute. She's kind of climbing up. It's just kind of really a little bit of a, um, a um, sketch of a person. It doesn't really even necessarily have to look like a person. She's kind of climbing down. Putting her hands up there. Okay. Now I'm going to take some blue and put some gifts down below. And maybe put um, a Christmas tree skirt down there. Just put the ribbons around. Let's see, I'll keep that red going for the Christmas tree skirt. 
skirt coming out. Some presents. Need a tree. And now I'm gonna put that window. And is it snowy where you are? I put that I put a window in the living room. And in outside the living room, I'll put oh uh, let's see. I think I'll just put some um, curtains on the window coming down. That could be blue. And side. Okay, and then maybe on the outside of the window you'll be able to see kind of a wreath through there. And on that wreath I'll have some red berries and some red ribbons. So wreath I'll decorate up for Christmas. On the ground I think I'll do Sort of a like rug coming out where the ladder's sitting on the rug. There we go. And let's not forget that chandelier coming down in the middle of the picture. Let's draw it up. Ooh, let's see. Let's draw it like that, and I'll put some light bulbs on the end. Chandelier to make it coming down. And let's put um a little boy down at the bottom holding the ladder for his sister. And there he is with his hands there, making sure that he's okay. She's okay up there. And put some brown pants on him. And some black shoes. Oh, they forgot to be green. Now they have black, and I'll do a green shirt for him since I've got it in my hand. There we go. I don't know. I think I need something else. What else can I put? I add a little more green to my tree. And a few more ornaments. I think that's what maybe I need. Just a few more pretty blue round all ornaments. Um, I have another pretty color that I like. It's more orange. Very colorful tree. All right. I feel like I need something here. What could I put there? What could I put there? Does anybody have any ideas of what you could put underneath the window? I know what I'm going to do. I will just do two windows, one above the other, and that will look good. This house will have two windows, two sets of curtains coming down. Since it turned out to have such tall walls. All right, boys and girls, are you ready for the big reveal? Let me draw my little wreath in the second window, get a bow on there, and some berries. And there is our picture. I think I'm going to draw just a little red up top to put something there and give the some fringe to the little rug. There we go. Maybe I'm going to decorate with some swirls. All right, boys and girls, here is my big reveal, and I can't wait to see what you all draw if you would like to send it to me. All right. She's putting that, she just put that straw on top of, the star on top of the tree, and now she's climbing down with her brother's help. And of course, you would never, ever, ever do that at home by yourself um, because it would be much too dangerous. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed drawing a tree with me today and look forward to the next video. Remember to subscribe and until next time, be kind to one, uh, one another and keep smiling.